the ring visually disappears. The ring goes through the magician's finger. And the magician produces a ring from thin air. The magician vanishes the ring. And then visually produces it again. The ring teleports between the magician's hands. Hey, how's it going everybody? Oscar Owen here and in this video I'm going to be teaching you 8 amazing ring tricks that anybody can do. These tricks are visual, easy and always get crazy reactions. So if you're ready, let's go to the table and start learning. The magician has a pen and a ring. He taps the ring and it instantly vanishes. So hold the pen in this hand and you want to make sure that your palm is completely open. And then hold the ring in your left hand and place it just above your palm. Then what you're going to do is tap the ring three times with the pen. The first two taps are normal, so you go one, two, and then on the third tap, all you're going to do is chuck the ring into this part of your hand here. So it's very hard to do this slowly of course, but you go one, two, and then you chuck it and you're going to catch it in this hand. So at full speed it looks like this. You can now show your hand completely empty and then the ring is just in this hand here. You can give the pen out to be inspected and take the ring away. The magician pulls the ring through his finger. Simply take a ring and put it on your finger. You want to put it on your little finger and you want the ring to be bigger than your little finger. So make sure it's not a really small ring. All that's happening is as you move your hand forward, this finger remains loose and it flies back and you literally just pull it off your finger. So you push the ring that way towards the spectator and make sure your little finger's loose and it looks as if the ring has jumped through your finger. If you are interested in learning incredible card tricks including flourishes, cuts, shuffles and more and tricks that are just too good to reveal on YouTube then check out my magic card course in the first link in the description below. The course contains some of the best tricks ever created and will give you the ability to walk into a room and impress anybody that you like. So go and check out Card Magic Pro in the first link in the description. The magician produces a ring from thin air. So this is a very fun and easy way to show that your hands are completely empty. Then whenever you want to, you can just squeeze your hand and produce a ring. So this is called edge grip. And essentially all you're doing is placing the ring in this position here and from quite a few angles, you can't see the ring. So in the performance, I just had the ring here, and then all you do is you squeeze your hand, and this causes the ring to pop out of this position here, and into your palm. So this is just a quick visual way to produce a ring and basically pluck one out of thin air. The magician rubs the ring and it slowly melts onto his little finger. Begin by placing the ring on your middle finger like this. Then what's going to happen is your other hand comes over and it starts to rub the ring. However, under the cover of this hand, your little finger is going to bend down. All you now need to do is drag the ring so it goes over your little finger and then you can straighten your little finger out again and it creates the very visual illusion that you've just rubbed the ring onto your little finger. So your hand will come over, you start rubbing, your little finger goes into this position, you keep rubbing, keep rubbing and then you straighten your little finger out again and then pretend to rub it onto your little finger.
The magician takes the ring, vanishes it, and then visually produces it again. Hold the ring between your thumb, middle, and first finger. Here's how this works. So your thumb comes in, and then what happens is this thumb knocks your thumb holding the ring to the side, and this will cause the ring to fall into the palm of your hand. So your hand comes in, knocks the ring to the side, and then you continue to pretend to go and grab the ring. And that essentially is the vanish segment of this trick. The next thing you want to do once you vanish the ring is your hand comes away and the ring will be in the palm of your hand here. You want to then just curl your fingers around the ring and this means you can now display the ring as if nothing is in your hand and this is called Ramsey's subtlety. So the ring's just here but it looks like there's nothing in your hand. You then reveal that the ring has completely vanished. At this point, you then want to produce the ring again. Open your hand, but make sure your fingers remain up, and this will hide the ring from your spectator's point of view. Now what you need to do is come in with your other hand and place these fingers in your palm. Then simply close your hand and bring the ring into your fingers and open up your hand again to produce the ring. The magician places the ring in his right hand and teleports it to his left hand. The jumping ring is very easy to do. All you need to do is place the ring in your right hand and place it to the right of your right hand, so just up here. Then what's gonna happen is at the same time, both hands are gonna go down like this. However, as you do that, you're gonna be chucking this ring to the side and it will land under your left hand. But this happens so fast that the spectator won't see it. So the ring starts here and it goes there. You can then bring this hand up, brush to show there's nothing there, point to your other hand and, re and reveal that it's magically teleported. The magician shows his hands. He reaches into his empty right hand and produces a ring. Begin by taking the ring and placing it on the back of your hand here. So long as your hands are up in the spectator's eye line, they won't be able to see this ring. So just make sure you tilt your hand upwards as well. Now close the hand that holds the ring and then take your other hand and place all your fingers and thumb into this hole here. You now have all the cover in the world to take your thumb and simply grab the ring and pull it into your hand. At this point, you rotate your hand and open up your fingers to reveal the ring. The ring instantly vanishes. For this trick, you need to attach a ring to a rubber band to a safety clip. Attach this contraption to the side of your shirt and then hold the ring at your fingertips. You need to make sure you cover the rubber band with your fingers and then keep your hand palm down so that the spectator can't see the rubber band. Then simply place the ring into your hand and when you let go, the ring will fire backwards into your side. The magician shows his hands empty and then produces a ring. This is a very easy ring production that you can learn in a couple of minutes. So take the ring and place it in the fleshy part between your thumb and first finger. So you place the ring here and then turn your hands over. What you're now going to do is brush both sides of the hand that doesn't contain the ring. So the ring is hidden here and you simply brush this side and this side. And this creates the illusion that both hands are empty when in reality you're not showing this side of your hand. So brush both sides of your hand, making sure your hand isn't flat but ankled downward slightly. And then once you're ready, 
tilt your hand up and let the ring drop into your fingers here and then produce it. So at full speed, it looks like this. You brush this side, you brush this side, and then you produce the ring. Thanks so much for watching, and remember to check out Card Magic Pro in the first link in the description if you're looking to learn tricks that I'll never teach on this channel just because they're too good. I'll see you in the next video.